Hello folks and welcome back to Let's Play Brain Lord. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. That's where I left off. I found lots of strange things at the rooms. I heard you can trade them west of here in Toronto, so I'm going there. You're going to Canada? Better pack something a little bit uh, less breezy than what you're currently wearing, Cassian. Just, just saying. Like, seriously, you guys should see Cassian's fan art. Or, not fan art, but actual art art. She looks like she's gonna freeze her little ass off. Anyways. So cold. I envy the town of Toronto, south of here. Stays warm all year long because of the underground heat from the nearby Droog Volcano. That's a weird sounding volcano. A great time with Rubians, an old man from Toronto. I wonder where we're going next. I hope he comes again sometime. <laughs> Alright. Uh, first off, I'm going to see if the Dudicus of... Oh, hey, Ferris. You defeated the strange ghosts in the ruins? They're not exactly ghosts. They were like freaking... Yeah, sure, ghosts. You don't look that strong. I've changed my mind about you. Aw, oh, gee, thanks. Love your vote of confidence in me, Ferris. Oh, he's gone. Damn. I was kind of hoping to buy the last couple of fairies. Oh well, I guess I'll just uh, see if I can't find someone to translate the silver plaque. Maybe that old man that was talking about the dragons. Back just over, yeah, you know, over here, the two-story one. I could sell off all of my stuff. And damn it, I forgot to grind again. Oh well. They say you brought back some strange writings from the ruins. Who told you this? I, I talked to like four people when I came back. Would you show them to me? Sure. Might be the silver plaque. A friend of mine named Rubens is... Rubens, sorry. Is doing research on the Abel civilization at this library in Toronto. If he can... can yeah. If he can decode the silver plaque, he can find out why the civilization was destroyed. So, I guess I'm going to Toronto. Cool. Actually, did she have anything for me? Used to take trips here and there with the room they aren't. There weren't any expensive things in that room, but did you find anything useful? Eh, I guess it could count. I guess it could count the uh, shield as being useful. Actually, I should probably sell some of these items. Oh, excuse me. I probably should sell some of these items that I got in my travels. Because sweet, filthy money is awesome. I like being able to buy stuff. What can I say? This is one of those games that I actually did really enjoy back in the day because of its puzzly elements and whatnot. Because there wasn't much about character growth, say for equipment, and you didn't get equipment unless you were traveling around and exploring shit, so there was no chance of you really to miss any equipment. It's kinda cool like that. Is that a mushroom? It looks kind of mushroomish. Oh, I forgot to use those drops too. Oh yeah, well. I forget things, people. Yes, leaving already, because I don't want anything from you. Go away. Now, what do you have now, Mr. Barn Weapon Shop? You have nothing. Nothing of value. You are useless to me. Sorry. I really dig some of this music. Oh, that's right. I should go to over overclocked.org, I think it is. Yeah, they have a butt ton of remixed video game music. I'm going to Toronto. My fiance is waiting for me. Found lots of jewels and have n enough money for the wedding. I hate to admit you defeated the monsters, not me. If you come to Toronto, be sure to look me up. Take care. Cheers. Peace out. Oh. Hmm. That's strange. It doesn't sound right. Rain getting married? Apparently. Right? Is that right? Very strange. Um. Did you just say something? No, no, nothing. Darius. Okay. 
Don't know why he yelled my name like that, but hey! It is about time for me to head down south to Toronto. After, of course, I take a little quick pause and shut these dogs up. Man, dogs can be such a nuisance, you know? Alright. So, down south of Arcs here is actually pretty damn brutal. For one, these guys actually take quite a bit of a beating. For such a little, about, little amount of gold, too. I'm gonna equip my sword, because I'm more confident with my sword than I am with a boomerang. Yeah! Eat boomerang, boosh, oh jeez. <laughs> ah, forget the amount of damage that they do! <laughs> I'm definitely gonna have to grind after this particular video, anyhow. Either that, or just run for my life! Probably run for my life. Yeah, running. Running away. Later, suckers. Oh jeez. Some more of you. Dodge. Strafe. Shift. Shaft. Ah. Oh my god. Well, I'm not dead. That's a plus. Sup, people? This is the town of Toronto. What? Came from Arcs 2? That's a tough journey. The building on the left is a hotel. Should rest for a while. Ramus the goblin has his eye on the town, so it's dangerous to go out when you're tired. Ramus, eh? Fun fact, uh, Remir, Lemiri, and Ramus are the three names that are commonly used in early Enix games. Just, you know, thought you ought to know. Knight says 200 gold! What do you guys think I am? Made of money? What do you have to say? The town is full of monsters. Uh, it doesn't look full of monsters. Ooh! New stuff to smash! I think I might go about smashing them. Mwahahaha. <laughs> oh, can't smash that. <laughs> uh, it's kind of devious when you think about it that, you know, go to this completely separate town for the sheer purpose of smashing stuff. I'm pretty sure there's other reasons to be around here, but... Oh, hey, Cassian. Hello, Darius. Good to see you. There are lots of interesting stories going around town. Sounds like a new adventure, doesn't it? What's this say? Assistant wanted, strong man or woman able to work nights will train. Toronto Civilization Research Office. Wanted, guard for the Northern Highway, Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter. Be careful of the Rathian. That's a, that's a Capcom joke. It's a Monster Hunter Capcom joke. Anyways. So, I'm just gonna pop in through these places really quick and smash up the races. Bosses. Pieces. They got a lot of them. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! You again! It's been a while. It's me, Meister. Decided to visit Toronto. Would you like to buy some jade? Sure. You. Did you resupply some of the old ones? Yes, you did. I don't want those. I just want an anger one. Very hard to catch. Alright, I have a very special name for this one. Based on a good old friend of mine. He gets angry a lot. And yes, he is. He did take the nickname of Link from Legend of Zelda. Anyways, Water Fairy, huh? Hmm. I'm lame like this. No wait. Even better because I like him more. I'm probably butchering how to spell his name though. Yes. Don't care if I ever see you again, seeing as I probably have all the fairies I'll possibly ever want from you. So go away. Oh, I can't get to that pot to break it. Dang it. The universe has turned against me. I'm also extremely out of money. Like, holy crap, I am out of money. <laughs> I came to this village with, 50, with nearly 50,000 gold on me. I came out of this village with less than 10. Lovely. Well, time to do ye old passage of breaking stuff. 
This guy's got a very colorful room door thing. Whoa. Okay, it's a shop. Well, it's an unfortunate shop that faces the everlasting destruction of Darius. What do you have to sell? World's cheapest, best stock tool shop. Okay. You're a tool shop, not a weapon shop. Yes, leaving already. Go away. I don't want to talk to you. You don't have anything that interests me. Maybe except for those, uh... I don't know why I'd smash those again. Hmm, look at this little row of things I cannot smash. Lovely. Hmm. wonder why there's a sword on the front of this building. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, it's a weapon and armor shop. Ooh, warp gate. I know that I'm mostly just killing time, destroying things, but it is fun. This is the stone mason weapon shop. Okay. I uh, you weren't kidding. Yeah. Okay, is that another boomerang? The chuckler. Thirty thousand. Son of a crap. Okay, uh, do I have anything I could sell him at the least for that better golden sword? I had to go and buy fairies. Jeez. Shows what I know what to do with my money. Well, I guess I'll have to find a way to make money t in order to afford that stuff. And this guy's an armor shop. Okay. Oh, I wonder how expensive this is going to be. Duh! Cheap! Right. Okay. We'll go with that. Oh, man. Maybe I should just grind down in those, uh... Ooh. Oh, of course it's locked. Is this one locked? Of course it's locked. Damn it. Here I was thinking to myself, you know what? It's a good idea. Stealing from these guys that have extremely high-priced items in their shops. That's that's a good idea. Yep. It was a good idea until I realized that they were locked. So, this is Vanessa's house. She was kidnapped by goblins. Okay. Her fiance Rain recently returned from his journey. They're both so cute. You know, except that one of them's been recently kidnapped by goblins, which I guess is the analog for monsters in this game. Well, is Vanessa safe? What? I don't believe it. I'm so angry. I'm gonna bring Ramus back with me. Well, I... Uh... What's up? I'm here to smash your vase. He's my daughter's fiancé. He's not a bad guy, but he's not too bright. Just took off without asking where the goblin is. Here my daughter's been kidnapped by a group of monsters led by a goblin. Ah, Vanessa. Yeah, she's probably dead. Monsters have a tendency to eat people. Just saying. Don't mind me just smashing your stuff. Where the hell was you? Okay, I can apparently smash desks too. I'd forgotten about that. But I, I think I'm going to get to smashing of any other things I can off camera because yeah for now I'll just reserve myself to vases and vases however you say it let's see oh thought that was a barrier of the town for a second might as well have been because this place is useless oh what's this Maybe he'll answer that question. Hey, it's dangerous outside. This village is always being attacked by monsters. Next time we're attacked, this library will be probably be destroyed. Oh, here's a library. Cool. We can see if we can talk to this old man about uh, the silver plaque after I destroy his stuff. Yes. What? What do you want, eh? Is that the silver plaque from the ancient civilization? A lot of people know about these strange things that are just popping up in ancient civilizations. Show me that silver plaque. It is! Will you give me that silver plaque? No, not for free. Hmm. How about this jewel? There's a fairy with a strange power inside it. Want you to trade for it? Uh, okay. I'll get to work decoding it right away. I'll let you know what I find out. Until then, uh, why don't you go play at the arena? 
If you say you are a friend of Rubin's, they will let you in. Ah, oh, jeez, what fairy was this? Crap! Um... Uh... Pam... Pam... Oh. Pamuk. No, wait, I already got a pa P name, don't I? Ta... 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 Tezo. Yeah, that's a very sound, very fairy sounding name. Tezo. Seriously, what, what one was it that he gave me? I swear, if it's one that I already have, I might be, like, one that I bought. Look for... That's D-Crab. Oh, it's this one. Oh, this is the life gym. Oh, hell yeah. And I can't go down there to the... Yeah. Okay, so that's the life fairy. That's the one that will constantly heal you. Which is cool, because I like being healed. And smash. I can't smash that crate. Damn it. I just want to smash your vases and your crates and your shite. Which again, the life fairy is probably one of the ones that will be a little bit more valuable to level up. If only simply because, you know... Constant life healing source. Yeah, kind of. Um, don't mind me, ladies. I'm just breaking your stuff. Welcome to the Bilbao, Bilbaira, Bilbaira, sorcerer shop. Bilbaira. They got a ton of spells. None that I can afford. I'll be able to afford them when I come back. I swear, Bilbaira. I don't know. Ladies, I'll come back here when I get the money. Ladies, how about that one? That's less offensive than, you know. What about these large houses? Guys got a lot of things for me to break, don't you? I'm gonna be slightly pissed off that's the kid. Ooh, this is a lot of rooms. I'll, I'll check them out after I check out the arena because the arena is bound to have stuff for me to actually do, as opposed to just, you know, smash stuff. As much as I do love the smashing of stuff. Yeah, very chill sounding music. There's a desert to the east of this village called the Barren Land. I wonder if the monsters came from the Barren Land. But, uh, am I supposed to know? Sure. People have been kidnapped, been here alone, I didn't know that. Really? Got this lady friend here with you. Stonemason, the weapon dealer, used to be a locksmith. I can't imagine such a rude man ruining a, running a locksmith. I don't know. If you play D&D &D enough time, you'll realize that a lot of thieves are just dicks. I mean, that's thieves. I don't know if he was a thief. Do you know about the arena? The arena is under the shop. You're strong. Why don't you fight there? You can enter if you ask the owner of this place. He's in the back room. Okay. Go back there. Go back to the back room. Hi. What a good looking guy. What? Was that a question or a statement? I don't know. I kind of wish that I had bought stuff instead. What do you want? I'm the owner of this place. Arena? Nothing like that here. This is a wholesome place. Anyways, the key to my treasure chest is broken. The weapon shops here don't deal in duplicate keys. Is there a locksmith somewhere? Gee, I wonder what it is that I have to do. I probably have to run back to the blacksmith stonemason guy. Just to get that open. That's alright. Not like I'm doing any, really anything important besides trying to find my friend's fiance or anything. Try to get in the arena. I'm mostly just trying to get into the arena. Yeah. I prefer the arena than, you know, going out and... Venturing forth for some dude's fiance. This is not that place. Derp. It is obviously the one with the giant sword on the front of it. You know, the one that I looked at for half a second and said, Nah, that's not it. Alright. For the most part, do you want a duplicate key? There are some trial products upstairs. Go up there and look. I'm busy doing the books and can't get away right now. These tax forms are tough. Yeah, I feel ya. Oh yeah, 
If you want to talk to any of the people... Wait, aren't these locked? Nope, apparently not. Cool, two duplicate keys. Excellent. So yeah, you can just talk to the blacksmiths or whatever behind the counter. The old guy from the library is a character. He went to a far off arcs to buy old documents. I mean, he's a librarian, so I guess they're known to do that. They buy old stuff. Dun dun dun. So, just need to come back up to the library. It feels a little faster when you jump around, by the way. Don't ask me why, just... Like, compare it. Eh. It's like probably a half a frame faster. It's the little things that you really don't notice. Or care about sometimes. Bum 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 bum. So, Oh, can I have a duplicate key? Eh, sure, why not? Oh, it fits. Thank you, thank you. You were asking about the arena. Or to fight at the arena. Ah, sure. Maybe you should ask somewhere, someone where the arena is. What? The arena has a bad reputation. The neighbors here really hate it, so I had tried to keep it a secret. But the rumors spread rapidly among the fringe element, so now I'm doing a good business. So, it's here at the inn, but I have to ask someone where it is. Enix, what the hell's wrong with you and your translation teams? Are you a friend of Ruben's? I haven't seen that old guy for a long time. If you're a friend of his, you must have come to fight the arena. It's over there. Make some money. Gladly. So, if I remember correctly, you can actually gamble in the arena as well. But, I've yet to really explore much into the gambling aspect of the arena. This is the arena, where rough people fight to the finish. Want to bid on someone? No. I don't have that kind of money. Oh, uh, what's up, Ferris? I've been looking for you. Darius, Barnes says he wants to talk to everyone in a room on the first floor of the hotel. Please come. Cashian, where is that kid? Well, I'd love to, but I've got a arena to fight in, actually. Oh no, I lost. My money is gone. What should I do? Mother will yell at me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. That's that's terrible, guy. I'm sorry. I'm a fan of Dr. Dr. Hirai. Do you have a favorite? It's a lot more fun if you have a favorite. Alright, Hirai. Go, go, go. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, well, are the warriors fighting in the arena all rich? Probably could get a little bit richer fighting in the... Uh, hey, hey, outsiders can't come in here. I'm not an outsider. I want to fight. Oh, Get out. This is warrior's right... Oh. Damn it. All I want to do is kill some guys for profit. Is that too much to ask? I guess it is. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha Fine, I can't fight here, I'll just break your bar. That's probably a bad idea. Can I talk to this guy at all? I can. Hey, you can't come behind the counter. What, you wanna fight in the arena? Hmm, I'll talk to them. Go to the waiting room behind the stage. Yes. Fighting in the arena, I shall go. That's not the waiting room. It is locked. Is this one it? Can't use magic or items when fighting the arena. Can only use certain weapons and armor. So I guess I really should get some really good weapons and armor before I go into the arena. Today's ranking: Blue Dragon, King Bull, Iron Bear, Iron Bull Man, Bokujin, Borkujun, rather. I can't break those. Damn. All right, let's check over here. Hmm, that guy and this guy fight, and wait, I'm playing in my fight card. Talk to you later. Sure, okay. This is results, deaths, mortalities, critical, injured, injured, injured. That's a word, Darius. You know what? I'm not never gonna. Yeah, I got an idea. What's in here? It's locked. 
Um, where's that duplicate key? There it is. Received from the snow mission can only be used in the village. Awesome. What about it is in here? Oh! What do you want? Get out of here before you get hurt. Oh, jeez. Uh, looks like you're square on hurting me, sir, so I'm just gonna sit in the back here and I can't cast a magic at you from there. Remember, can't use magic in the arena. Ha ha ha. I, I'm a headliner in the arena. I can't believe I've been defeated by a kid like you. Hey, I even made a small bit of profit. <laughs> ah, that's terrible of me. I might be evil. Yes. Do, 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 do. Shirt one fighter in the arena today. Darius, you're a warrior. Why don't you give it a try? Um, nah, not at the moment. I just want to read this and probably call it an episode. Yesterday's results. Deaths, zero. Mortally wounded, one. Ah, 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 ah. Blue Dragon Waiting Room. Mysterious Injury. Recovery Impossible. Cause Unknown. <laughs> oh man, I'm such an evil dick! Uh, Alright. I'm gonna head back to the hotel. And that is probably where I'm gonna call in an episode. Because I definitely got... If I'm going to proceed with the plot much more, I really do have to uh, power up my fairies. Probably get some really good equipment. <laughs> oh man, I'd almost forgotten completely about uh, mortally wounding the blue dragon guy there. I mean, I didn't kill him. I'm not that evil. I did, however, mortally wound him. So, yeah, I'll probably never fight ever again. Probably sucks for him, because that was probably his money winner right there. Oh well. So, it wasn't that chilly of a morning. It's been a chilly night though. It's freaking cold up here in the mountains. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode here. And I'll see you guys in the next video where we shall take on the arena. Take care. Cheers.